So Cole, you're telling us that your horse wants to to hump up and buck a little bit when you break him into a trot. Um, and we did a video already about uh, doing that sort of thing. You want to use suggest ask tell, but the thing about it is, is when you're so what you're going to do is you're going to turn that pressure up till you get a change. So you might ride forward and squeeze, and you might use your feet to bump forward, and then you might get to the point where you got to spank him. But the main thing is, is when you allow that horse to go, when you turn up that pressure and get him to move out, you don't pick up a check on him right away and say, no, I want you to move out, but I don't want you to go that fast. You have to take what they offer you. So you might get, get yourself in a safe place, get yourself in an arena, turn that pressure up, get that change, and go as fast as he wants to go for a little while, then redirect that energy, bring him down, and start over again. <clears throat> when you do it enough times, if that horse is leaving in quite a hurry, what it's going to do is find out there's not that big a rush to go anywhere. So what they're going to probably start doing is start coming back to you. But the main thing is when you get them to move out, make darn sure you allow them to go someplace. So give them to where they can trot or lope off at a stride or two before you bring that energy down. And just keep working at it. Build it up, bring it down. We call that energy, and if you check out my videos like that, the pendulum exercise, where you get them to move out with feeling, they could come back with feeling. And do you have any advice with the wanting to buck when asked to, to lope? You know, I'm thinking that probably without seeing the horse, that, that wanting to buck a little bit about moving out, it might have something to do with is that when, when they move out that you're saying, I don't want you to go that fast. So get prepared, get your horse rode down a little bit, maybe when you work on him so he's not so fresh that he feels like he has to. But you need to be able to ride through that. And what I say is, if he wants to get a little humpy, get him moving out. You know, they get humpy because they're, they're sticky about moving their feet. They need to move their feet.